God bless and keep you always. May your wishes all come true. May you build a ladder to the stars and climb on every His name is Nex Benedict. Well, this event was a vigil um, to honor the life of Nex Benedict, a 16-year-old non-binary uh, indigenous um, high school student who was um, killed as a result of uh, violence and bullying at his um, high school in Oklahoma. Even though, you know, most of us, any of us didn't know Nex or anybody in that community, um, it's important to show solidarity um, within the queer community as a whole. And also, um, I don't really think that anybody supports children dying in any capacity, um, regardless of, of how they identify or the beliefs. Like, um, so it's important for us to speak to that and you know call to action um, to stop things like this. Unfortunately, Nexus situation isn't unique. As we reflect, I not only want to think about Nex but our other siblings too. I think about those that haven't even reached the news, who died in silence, but we will not forget about you. I'm a member of the Ferris community. This institution prides itself on having progressive founders who believed in providing education for, quote, all people in all the states. But it's not up to them, it's up for us today to decide if that belief will be our reality. Our grief is a sign of sanity, a sign of rage, power, and change. Our shared grief is a sign of resistance. We cannot afford to let it go unspoken, and we cannot afford to allow it to become despair or lose hope. I think that if we match that, but not with their violence, if we match that with positive call for change, if we match that with bold action, it will be our voices that will rise above theirs. Interpersonal violence and bullying and harassment don't have a place here at Ferris. As one of the people who addresses these concerns here at Ferris and as a member of the queer community, I just want to say that I'm here. I'm here and I'm ready to listen, I'm ready to engage in these dialogues and to help make Ferris and Big Rapids a safer place and I need your help. So in terms of resources, um, there's the LGBTQ Resource Center of course on campus um, as well as um, some really great faculty and staff members too. Um, for mental health resources, there's a personal counseling center, there's the Anti-Violence Alliance, um, and there's Pride Big Rapids within the community of Big Rapids in West Michigan as well.